What's going on guys? So I am back. Last time I made a video um, about Black Girls Workout 2 DVD, it was on Wednesday, right? Yeah, Wednesday, because that's when I started it, as you can see. I just finished it about, about five minutes ago, and then I had some water. And I have to set everything up here for you guys. This is on the computer. So, um, okay. So let's get right into it. I like it. I like the DVD. I don't know why it's so different from other DVDs that I've done. Because, you know, I've done so many workout DVDs. And for some reason, I just it just didn't motivate me. I think the reason why it didn't motivate me because... I didn't know exactly why I was doing certain workouts. My boobs are coming out. You know, doing certain workouts. And what I liked about this DVD, they said, okay, we're going to do these type of squats for your butt, This the lunges. Like, it inspired me to do more. When Lana uh, was just saying, the deeper the squats, the less the cellulite. And I really wish I took pictures of my cellulite on my legs and now what they look like. Literally, it looks like they're being erased. And I just started this DVD on Wednesday. So that's pretty impressive that I'm starting to see results already. Um, I took two days off. I took Friday off and I took yesterday off from the DVD. Uh, Friday, I was just all over the place. I had to pick up my son early. I had a lot of things to do on Friday, so I could not do it on Friday. But I did do it on Saturday. And also, I didn't do it yesterday. Like I said, you know, sometimes you are really that busy. You know, there was a birthday party and we didn't get in the house until around like nine o'clock and the kids had to go to bed. And it was just so much chaos yesterday. So I really couldn't really get into how I want to. But this morning, I normally do this DVD in the morning as soon as my son goes to school and, uh, and then at nighttime, I do my treadmill because recently I just bought a treadmill. And I have uh, six pound weights because in the DVD, as the requirements in the back of the DVD, it says all you need is a yoga mat, you know, exercise mat, or a, a and also uh, five pound dumbbells. Now, the dumbbells that I have, they're not really dumbbells. They're, I have, are Everlast. They're six pounds. So the whole thing is weights. Now the difference between this and dumbbells, dumbbells, as you guys know, is long and the weights are on each side, okay? But with this one, there's weights all around. This whole thing is six pounds. It's not on the sides. It's not just right here. This whole thing is a weight. Now, the pros and cons. The pros, like I told you, you see results. The only way you see results, and let me, make this clear like all my videos that I make about hair every wig is not going to be for you you know all different results are different just like workouts you know when you see success stories that doesn't mean it's going to be actually you like I saw one girl who lost most of her um, belly weight and doing it in a day now, we don't know if she had kids. We don't know if she had, you know, she could be 19, 20 years old. We're all different. All, all our body shapes and the way that we lose weight is totally different. So I have two kids. I'm 28. So right now, my body uh, loses weight in a different way, okay? Uh, I went on to, the tre uh, went on to my uh, scale, and I was still the same weight, but... I'm losing inches, which is crazy. And I know this is going to like really mess people's minds up because at the end of the day, it's not all about the numbers on a scale. You can lose weight. There's two ways of losing weight, losing water weight and there is toning up weight. Okay. You put on, sometimes you put on weight when you're toning up and that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm actually toning up more than just losing a whole bunch of weight. And I'm going to actually read something to you guys real quick that I got from a, a website um, exactly about the whole weight loss thing. Okay. Um, somebody wrote on Yahoo that, you know, they're not 
they're now losing weight and they're doing weight training and everything and they're not seeing any weight loss on the scale but they're seeing inches like myself I'm seeing inches in my arms dramatically go down I, I put on my trench coat yesterday and it was loose I put on a size uh, 10 yesterday and it went over my stomach like my stomach wasn't hanging out on the sides on the front it was all smoothed out right here it was I'll show you the picture. muscle mass focus on fat loss not weight loss when you talk about losing weight what you re usually mean by slimming down so a lot of people are so focused on okay slim down that's weight loss no it's not so much that but slimming down doesn't always mean losing weight it may sound and, and it does sound odd. It says it right here in the article. It says, sounds odd. We know. But possibly to get thinner without actually seeing a change in your weight. This happens when, happens when you lose body fat while gaining muscle. So we're gaining muscles right now, okay? Uh, your weight may stay the same even as you lose inches. A sign that you're moving in the right direction. I'm happy about that. And also it says here, the truth about your weight. What does your weight say about you? If you think about it, the number doesn't tell you a whole lot. The scale shows your weight, but does it tell you how much of that weight is muscle and how much is body fat or how much that weight is water, bones, or organs? Water is heavier than body fat, muscle cells, and even the bones. Pretty much, that's what's going on with me. I am gaining muscles and I'm losing inches, which I love because I'm slipping into, you know, certain things that literally were so so tight on me also here are the cons that i have for the dvd or maybe on the next dvd because i know they're going to make another dvd they can't just just make this one dvd they have to have another dvd um you know focus on calf muscles because we do some people have thighs and then you get to the, like jennifer lopez she has thighs but she doesn't have calves uh, also, uh, Tyra Banks, she's always, always, you know, told us about that she has no calves or she has thighs. So maybe, like, focus on our, our, our calf muscles as well. Also, uh, a cool-down stretch moment at the end of the DVD. Because at the end of the DVD, it ends with Ellen, and we're doing uh, front rolls and, and working on our upper body. And then after that, it's just done. You know, they're talking about, you know, go to the website for more information and things like that. I would like to have like a cool down stretch, you know, stretch out the muscles that we just pretty much stretched out, you know, worked out and everything. So I would love to see that in the next DVD coming up. Uh, I noticed uh, there is no rest time. So I advise people who are beginners. I'm not a beginner when it comes to uh these type of DVDs that continuous exercise. It's not a, you know, okay, five guys, okay, take a breather. Okay, we're going into the next exercise. No, this is like continue, 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 continue. That's the best way to do it. I'm, I know you guys are really like, what? What? I'm, I can't do that. I can't do No. The more you say you can't do it, you're not going to do it. But you have to pull through it. And like I said, I've learned from other DVDs how to just continue to go. You have to learn how to breathe. This is my fourth day doing this, so I had to learn how to breathe. Breathe, um, breathe through your nose and out through your mouth. And you just have to really, really concentrate on the exercise. Like today, the moves were so much easier for me to do. I wasn't on the floor like I was on the first day because, like I said, I, I haven't been working out like this in a while. So my body was like, whoa, what the hell just happened? Were you doing crunches? Chick, why are you doing trick? Girl, go get a cheeseburger or something. But so that's what happens. So you have to work when you're breathing. Also, um, they do give you a 10 second cool down between Lana and uh, Lana and Ellen. I think right before you get into the kickboxing, you can breathe, you can get some water and then get right back to it. But that's how you burn the most calories when you get right into the next exercise but if you're a beginner you know take a like five seconds and then get right back into it the great thing about this dvd is that you can click pause and if you want to redo the move that you kind of messed up or you kind of half-assed you can just click going back so you don't have to rewind and get back to it each segment has its own segment by going forward or backwards um 
it kind of threw me off when another con was it threw me off when Lana was doing uh, her lunges because they were edit and it will be going it, it just threw you off because once you, you're going down but then they'll edit and then you're like okay we're gonna do the sumo and you're like wait hold up weren't we just doing lunges so it, they kind of edit it a little bit weird where you're kind of thrown off about what launch are you on um how many launches do you have left because she'll say two more and then let's do this and so it, it kind of uh conflicts with you really focusing well, pretty much that's all the cons that I have. Nothing huge, nothing big or anything, but that's the only thing that kind of that throws me off. But now that I know the DVD, it's not that I, I can calculate, okay, I'm going to be down because they're going to start down again because that's the way it's edited. Also, Lana shared a, a nice secret for us women so we can burn fat a little bit faster on certain problem areas. And here it is. This is called... Abilene, which is a moisturizer cleanser. You're like, whoa, moisturizer cleanser. It takes off the makeup. Now, I use this as a makeup to take off my makeup. It reminds me of the oil cleanser by DHC. And you rub it on your face. The makeup comes right off and you just wipe it off and your skin looks so clear. It looks so, you know, smooth and it's still moisturized. But she doesn't use it for that. Even though this is multi-purpose, but she doesn't use it for that. What she does is she'll take... A little bit, not that much. You don't need it much because I got this. I had this for about a week, even before I got the DVD, because she had it on her Instagram. What you do is you take some and you put it on whatever problem areas that you want to burn off fat, whether it's your inner thighs or your midsection. Mine is my midsection and sides, as you can see right here. So what I did was I rubbed it on my belly, and you put a saran wrap. I didn't have saran wrap. I had <laughs> I had bubble wrap, <laughs> but it still works the same, okay? It still works the same. So anyway, you put your wrap around your belly or your thighs, wherever you have your problem area, and then you can either work out like that or you put some type of sweatband. What I did was I have this these two girdles that I do not use. So I have this girdle, which is like it's really stretchy and then I have a more firmer one so I wear this while I work out and literally when I take this off I'm dripping wet my belly is dripping wet of sweat so I advise you to go in the bathroom or have towels or paper towels around so you can wipe it up because you're gonna be drenching all over the place but but that's all I have, guys. You really have to be consistent with this DVD. You can't do it for a weekend and be like, oh, I'm healthy, team healthy. You gotta be consistent. If you wanna see results, you have to be consistent. Like I said, I took two days off and I still see results. You have to do the workout. If you do a half ass, you're not going to see results, people, okay? You're not gonna see results. So stop it. This is not a miracle DVD. You have to put in work. And these are. These are uh, these are workouts, you know. At first, I hated lunges, and I hated, I still hate lunges. Um, squats, I hate squats. But for some reason, being that I've been doing this so consistently for these few couple of days, today it wasn't so bad. I actually was like, yeah, yeah, girl, go ahead, do it. I wasn't, I wasn't yelling at Lana as much today, you know. The other days, I was cursing out, throwing stuff at the TV. But, you know, it was so much easier, and the upper body was so much easier, but I was still sweating. No matter how much easier it is, it's still effective. So, I'm seeing inches. Uh, you saw the pictures. Well, you're about to see the pictures now. And that's pretty much it. I will be back next Monday to show you more results, and we'll see what happens, okay? All right, guys. I know this is very informal, the way I'm doing this, but I'm really tired, and I'm about to take me a a nice little nap. What time is it? 9 o'clock? 9.10. All right, guys. Love you. Peace. Hey guys, the results are in. The left is from the first day that I started, which was Wednesday, and the right is this morning. The left front view is on the first day, the right this morning. The left is on Saturday, the right this morning. And as you can see, the back fat is melting away.